Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus sun, Cancer rising, Aquarius moon, in the light path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I am here with a channeled messages reading from your person for all of my Tauruses who are watching. So if you have Taurus as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Taurus, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation, in communication, at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart, Taurus, is your person. That's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and officially begin and get started, please keep in mind that this is and will be a general reading for your sign, Taurus, so it may or may not resonate for you here specifically, and if it does not, Taurus, please don't take it personally. Also, Taurus, if you are interested, I will have your extended reading posted as well. So your extended reading will follow up with the energy that we go over within this reading and we'll utilize some tarot cards and oracle messages. So the extended reading will be available and posted in the comments and in the description below. But without further ado, Taurus, let's see what we have making its way towards you for the month of November, please. Let's see who this person that Taurus is dealing with or the person that Taurus is attracting, please. Let's see how they truly feel towards Taurus. And let's see the true feelings and emotions, please. Let's go ahead and reshuffle. So far we have four messages. What else do we need to know about this person, please, for Taurus? Let's do one more, please. All right, Taurus, so we have a couple, two more extras that came out, but we'll go ahead and take all of what we have. We will have some more messages as well, but first we have your love and energy deserves to be matched, nothing less. Heart overhead. We also have your vibe is so refreshing. When we met, it was no doubt you're what I want. It's best as sooner than later I have you. We also have I'm working on healing my past. There were some things I needed to get right before I could be ready for you. When I look at you, I forget my past. We also have your time is valuable. It's an honor. You want to spend it with me. And two extras. We have natural beauty. Okay, we also have another extra. Butterflies won't carry this the whole way. And any interaction with you is the highlight of my day. So we have like a, a full spread Taurus. But we will still have those additional messages. Let's go ahead and get into this energy one by one. I do feel like this is a person that you've already connected with Taurus. But... With them coming back or resurfacing, it's like there's still a whole connection to pursue. I feel like you and this person had a couple encounters or you two went on a couple dates, Taurus, but nothing amounted into perhaps what you had in mind or where you wanted to funnel this energy. But I feel like this person is resurfacing, Taurus, because... The thought of you is still on their mind, and I feel like from your side, Taurus, it's like, don't come back into my life unless it's something serious. So I feel like that's the energy that you're promoting moving forward here. And depending on why this connection, why you and this person went your own separate ways in the past, that could factor into your doubt or the inconsistencies that you want to avoid with this person it's like we got to know each other to an extent but then it fizzled out I didn't like that about you I didn't like that you did that to me but I feel like they're they're coming back towards because they know that something 
is worth worth doing so. They know that you, Taurus, this connection is worth pursuing. And if they just move past it without trying, it would be like, I know that there was something more that I missed out on. So that's the overall energy that we have here, Taurus. First we have, or first we're going to go ahead and get into your energy. So we have, I'm working on healing my past. Any of these energies could be roles reversed or um, please only take what resonates, but I'm working on healing my past. I do feel like this is your energy, Taurus. And I feel like this is someone that you still might be interested in, but because they didn't show you that initiative or they didn't show you that action, I feel like you, in a way, learned or trained yourself to just keep keep it moving for your own good because perhaps you could romanticize things or it's like getting caught up because you don't know where this person's actions are at or where their mind is at, what they want with this. So I feel like once this person showed you any energy of disinterest or them being uninterested, that's when you you kept it moving for yourself, for your own good, like I said. So I'm working on healing my past. I do feel like this is your energy, Taurus. And perhaps this could be a shared energy as well. Um, it's like they came in contact with you, Taurus, but for themselves, they just weren't ready. They were immature about things or they could have handled distancing themselves or exiting this connection in a more mature way here, Taurus. So I'm working on healing my past. We also have, there were some things I needed to get right before I could be ready for you. So I feel like this is this person's energy, Taurus. And this is another reason to why I feel like this is someone you met. The interest, attraction was there, but nothing more amounted from it. I feel like that's another reason to why if this person just ignored their intuition or they ignored this feeling about you after the fact, it's like I had, it's like that, that phrase, you miss a hundred shots that you don't take here. So not only did they have the opportunity, but then they fumbled it. And then now it's just open-ended. I wonder if Taurus would still be interested in getting to know me. I wonder if I would still have that chance. So now that they have more of a clear frame of mind, Taurus, I feel like this is a reason to why they want to take action. It could have also just been them sorting out, what do I want from a relationship, casual or even long-term Taurus? What am I ready for? It could have also been player energy involved where someone had their options you had their you had your options too Taurus but I feel like you were able to single it out as far as I'm interested in this one person I want this one person let's see how it goes we have your vibe is so refreshing I feel like there's a comfort about your presence Taurus but also just how you two match with one another you Taurus just being yourself you don't ever have to try hard I feel like this person liked you for who you are and your presence. Maybe they complimented this on you, Taurus. Perhaps they complimented you on your fragrant fragrance or how you smell, Taurus, but your vibe is so refreshing. I feel like they knew that there was so much more to you, Taurus. It could have also been them not wanting to put the time into it investing into getting to know who you are and that's on them and now that this time has passed I feel like they're realizing that now we also have butterflies won't carry this the whole way I do feel like this is going back to your energy Taurus you're interested you're attracted to them but the anxiety that they gave you as far as not communicating or not pushing this connection forward that didn't make you feel any better so once again, how I mentioned romanticizing things, I feel like you took off those rose colored lenses once, once your intuition kicked in or it's like, you know what, this isn't everything I know I could receive from a partner. 
We also have any interaction with you as the highlight of my day. This could be your interview, Taurus. I feel like you did look forward to hearing from this person, but once again, anxiety or doubt kicked in because this person wasn't being consistent enough. We have your time is valuable. It's an honor. You want to spend it with me. This goes for your energy, Taurus. And I feel like perhaps you prioritize quality time. It could be all of the love languages, but because this person became distant or they left this connection, and you may have been the one reaching out to this person or trying to initiate things with them. But because it was mismatched or misaligned here, Taurus, I feel like you didn't feel as though your time was valued with this person. It's like people make time for the things and people they like. And what is meant for you or who wants to be in your life, Taurus, they'll take that time to get to know you. They'll take that time to make plans with you and stick with it. Even when it comes to communicating and getting back to you towards via text, via phone, calls, it shouldn't take 12 hours to get a response from someone, you know? So your time is valuable. It's an honor you want to spend it with me. Once this person made you feel like you were a burden or an option, I feel like that's when you pulled away once again for your own good. I'm working on healing my past. I never want to feel like an option. I never feel like I have to stoop below my, my level, my value, or bargain for you, bargain for you to see me. We have when we met, it was no doubt you're what I want. It's best if sooner than later I have you. I do feel like this is this person's energy, Taurus. They may have been the one to pursue you initially, chase you, go after you, but it's like once they quote unquote settled into getting to know you, I feel like that's when their interest sort of dwindled or even disappeared so I, I feel like you you might not like the attraction could still be towards this person but you're unsure about their energy their efforts because you don't appreciate the switch up it's like you lose interest I can lose interest as well it, it's like you were understanding up until they weren't understanding of your feelings and emotions and just providing you that that courtesy and that respect Taurus your love and energy deserves to be matched nothing less so I do feel like this is a personal message for you Taurus and that's a, another reason to why you're staying away from this person but we do have heart overhead so I feel like there's that shift in energy where this person once again is resurfacing and they're following their heart. They're letting their heart leap the way. But it's like, why do you know now that you want to pursue this to me? Or with me, excuse me. Why do you, like, what took you so long to pursue me? It's like, did you have your fun and now you're ready to be serious with, with me? And it's like, when someone shows us their true colors, that always sticks out to us. We can forgive, but forgetting, it'll still be a thing of the past. But we also have, when I look at you, I forget my past. So I feel like perhaps this person was caught up in a certain lifestyle, Taurus, and that lifestyle can vary if it does resonate. But even when I refer to lifestyle, it could be dating multiple people, being a player, having different options but with you Taurus I feel like you're you know what you're want you, you know what you want and you're you're not budging here so with you it's they're going to have to come correct with you Taurus they're going to have to match your your expectations and your standards so it's like if you want to put into that growth mindset, then you're with me. But if you don't, then I'm not going to play both sides for myself. So when I look at you, I forget my past. Also with your vibe, Taurus, and your energy, 
it's not complicated it's out of love love shouldn't be hard it shouldn't be complicated it shouldn't hurt here so i i feel like this person knows exactly what you're expecting here and exactly what you want when it comes to a person in a relationship so it's like leave the past behind us let's start something new and we also have natural beauty taurus a personal message for you perhaps this person complimented you on your natural beauty but basically you never have to do more than just show up and be yourself all right so we're done with these messages we will have some more messages right here once again if you are interested in your extended reading i will have that posted below it'll be a part of my patreon membership and in order to view and access that extended reading tours you'll either have to have a monthly membership which allows you access to any and all of my extended readings, no matter what the sign is Taurus. So there's the monthly membership option, which is $8.88 per month. Or if you do want to just follow up with this one specific extended reading, it will be available as a one-time purchase for a lower price. So feel free to check that out, Taurus, if you are interested. We'll see what is yet to come from this connection. But let's do a couple more pulls, please, for Taurus here. What else might be relevant for Taurus? All right, Taurus, let's go ahead and take from the top, or actually we'll take all three of these. The first message is give me your full attention. I feel like this is what you're demanding from this person. And when I say demanding, not begging, but it's like, Okay, apparently you want things to change between us, so not just say it and express it, but also show it. I have a plan for us, so it's like now this person is resurfacing, uh, committed to this connection, but like I said, Taurus, I feel like they know what you want, so just be careful of their words also matching matching their actions because I, I feel like you don't want to repeat a cycle with this person Taurus we have trust me I feel your energy so I feel like this is a this is an effect of you Taurus leaving this person alone um because at one point and not to say you were chasing them but you may have just wanted closure from this and closure can come in silence Taurus but I feel like you were following up with them or reaching out to them wanting to progress this but then you just stopped you may have left them on red Taurus the last time you communicated with them so I I feel like this energy is still lingering around this person definitely someone that like you crossed their mind Taurus an exchange in energy, perhaps our synchronicities. Little things matter to me, your energy, Taurus, and I feel like this person was slacking on that, unfortunately. We have, we will be together, and let's see what this one says. You make me see the endless possibilities there are. So yeah, Taurus, I feel like with this message, this contributes to the growth mindset that you want with your partner. And I feel like this person was very limited. I feel like they only wanted to organize certain things with you that would also keep this connection within like a box because they weren't ready to move forward. But it's like when they get with you, Taurus, if this does work out, they know that this will be full of expansion and abundance. You're not playing around Taurus. And we also have, we will be together. So this could be the energy of reconciliation between you two. Once again, we'll follow up and see what is yet to come based off of your extended reading, which will be posted down below. Let's see what signs might be relevant. First, we do have Libra for Taurus. Gemini, Libra, Gemini. So some air energy, 
Libra, Gemini, and Sagittarius. All right, Taurus. So that is all for your reading today, as always. I do appreciate the love here and the support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you all next time or within your extended reading. Bye.